Oh boy, what have I done? <laughs> I bought you packs today. No, you bought yourself packs. No, I didn't buy myself. I don't For know. content. I, I didn't even no care. I don't care. I literally told you I don't care. I you thought said you wanted the guy with the weird board with a face on it. Did you not say that? I don't Did you know. not say that? I said it's cool. How about the thing with the green head? I said it's With the wacky eyeballs. Cool. Just because I say something's cool doesn't mean I want it. In that video where we talked about these, you said, I want those. Roll back the footage. Oh, f I'm too lazy. So I didn't go back and roll back the footage. Somebody will. We bought packs from the Cartoon Network. He bought packs series one or from two? the Cartoon what Network Series 1 drop. Heather bought four packs, premium packs. You went prem, 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 prem. Very preming. Preming very hard today. I'm about to As prem you, got, you. I don't know what that means, but I'm down. You're what, you, I'm not going to say no. I'm going right in. I'm saying yes, immediately. You show me what that is. What's it? What? What does a uh, what's a premon got to? What are you gonna do? Do a premon on me? Where's the premon gonna happen on me? I can't. I have a lot of questions. I can't get them all out. I can't do it on YouTube. It's very violent. Oh, it's violent and stinky. When you say stinky, do you mean it's like the equivalent of your breath stinky. when you eat at that one place? Worse. What's that place you eat at? Kava. Ugh. Oh my god. It's Greek food. It's delicious, but it is very stinky. No toothbrush can stand up to the no. smell that comes even out of that the mouth. Even the next day, I'm oh. like, ugh. It's enough to make you want to throw up. I, I swear to you, it's, it's absolutely terrible. Look, but it's delicious. A lot happened today in the Funko world. There was a Funko Pop that sold out on, on Funko.com. Did you see it? It was a Care Bear. Yeah. It sold out. It was like a Merman Care Bear figure. What do you think? I thought it was a creature well, from the creature Black Creature from Lagoon. Black Lagoon. Merm is it Merman or what is he? He's a, a creature? creature from the black. The creature from the black lagoon. It sold out it on the website. Today. It was a five thousand piece. It was a five thousand piece. I didn't realize it, although I would have gone after it had I known it was a five thousand piece because <laughs> I am a numbers hoe, and I think we all know that. If you're a numbers hoe, I want to see it down in the comment section down below. Hashtag numbers hoe, bro. Also, uh, yesterday's video got a lot of people talking. Mm -hmm. It was a very good video. I hope you guys watched it. It was about Funko Bros. We put out a video yesterday talking all things Funko Bros and what they are doing wrong. We also found out from a commenter that knows what's going on that apparently he doesn't even have a Funko account. So Ooh. a lot of stuff that we said yesterday was allegedly. Totally, allegedly, a lot of stuff that we said yesterday may not have to actually do with Funko and more so the distributors that this person uses. I also allegedly heard that he was blocked from EE or Entertainment Earth. Yeah. And he threatened legal action against us. Yeah, for slander. That's crazy. I can't wait to go to court and explain under oath that I called him Funko Hose <laughs> because he takes your money and f**ks ya. And then the other thing that happened today is that Tiny Ghost drop their Wolverine Deadpool tiny ghosts. Did you happen to see that? Yeah. And they're amazing and they I really love fantastic. them. They're yeah, fantastic. They're really great. And, and I actually was able to get myself a pair of them. Super stoked over it. Uh, Reese O'Brien does it again. Why are you doing that? High five. You got oh. them. Yeah, I did. I got them. And there, there are chases. So these are really great little Wait, figures. Wait, there's chases? Yeah, there's chases. So what do you mean? there's a... Um, oh, yeah. okay. So this is the chase. It's the uh, X-Force Deadpool. Very cool. And then the variant of Wolverine with oh, the brown suit. Oh, he which, looks like he's wearing a thong on his chest. I like it. Yes, it's a it tiny, does. It's a tiny ghost thong. I love it, though. I think that tiny ghost is doing really fun things with they their are. figures. These two were like things I really needed in my life. I am super, I'm gonna talk about this, Deadpool Wolverine Ho. So hashtag Deadpool and Wolverine Ho because that's what I am. I'll buy anything Deadpool and Wolverine right now. I absolutely love it so much. So who wants to see us open up a bunch of Prems? Me! Me too. We want to open up these Prems, see what's inside. Can't wait to see this fail. But before we get into that, I want to let you know to go over to mischieftoys.com and pre-order your hoodie 
right now. We have all sorts of hoodies up for pre-order on mischieftoys.com. Go and pre-order yours. I am noticing that people aren't ordering typically one hoodie by itself. They're ordering multiple hoodies. Yeah. Because we do not do hoodies very often, so they're getting themselves ready for fall, y'all, and also winter time. I was so, gonna say hoodie season. It's but hoodie season and fall, y'all. Fall y'all and embarrass so, yourself. That's, that's fine. not embarrassing. You walk around with those big glasses on. Let's talk about it. You walk around with them big teeth in. Look, I've been getting a lot of looks by a lot of people. And it's a lot of good for me. They, I enjoy they it. can't believe how those teeth fit in that little mouth. That's something that they're wondering about. Now, if you go over to mischieftoys.com, you can buy those hoodies. And then if you're in the Coven of Mischief, we have special Coven of Mischief hoodies available as well. Heather, when does the pre-order end? This coming Sunday, the 15th at 10 p.m. Eastern. So make sure you go and get yours. We have quite a few designs to choose from, and they are amazing. Additionally, they each come with their own sticker. Look at that. Killer. It's killer, bro. And then next week we will have most likely a brand new drop that is going to blow your socks off. That's right. Mortem is on his way and he's coming and he's going to be coming very hard. So make sure you have your eyes and ears open for this. We will have more information coming your way, possibly this Sunday during our live. So this Sunday, make sure you tune in for all that Mortem news and goodness. We'll probably show the figure off then. So make sure you're there. All right, let's open up our prems. You okay. ready? Yeah. We got several prems. Very strange situation has occurred here in this room. Uh, Fritzy the cat has jumped up on Heather, and this is exactly what happened during the last drop, believe it or not, which is very bizarre. It's as if he knows that that Paul is going to be put to work tonight. Ah, he opened it. Okay, hold on, Fritzy, one more time. It's very important. Ah, there we go. Okay, Fritzy. Good job, buddy. Good job. He has no idea what he's doing. Oh, he's about to claw me. Be very careful, Heather. Move back. Just hold on there, Fritzy. Okay, here you go, buddy. All right, so we're about to open it, open this pack up, Fritzy. We didn't even turn the sound on. We didn't need the sound for this. All right, are we ready? Oh, he sh should he hit the reveal button no. also? <laughs> okay, let's see if, if Fritzy is our Ultra Samurai Jack. That's worth $5, but that's okay. Better than nothing. Yeah. Okay. What, what one did you want beside the guy with the wooden board? You wanted to use this, right? You wanted to use this that, dude? That would be, if I had to choose any of them, it would be... Another Samurai Jack. So two Ultras and the okay, same Okay, we got two pack. Ultras. Two Ultras, one pack. Two Ultras, one pack. So at least we pulled something, I guess. Uh, they put the Ultras in there for those who are unaware. So it makes you feel like you did something. Yeah, and, well... Should we get him back and push the button? He's behind you. No, he got you ultras. I don't trust yeah, but his But he's luck. good. Come on, he's good. Let's get him back. No, he he, he doesn't want to do work Fritzy, right Fritzy, would you mind pushing the buttons for us? Where's the other? Where's Valo? Let's get Valo in here. He, he would put... Valo he, would do some He does not work. like being in here when we record. Are you kidding me? That's why he's never... All right, Fritzy, let's try this one more time. I I'm... hope he beats you up. Here, come on, Fritzy. Now, you hold him. And then I'm going to get the mouse to the right spot. All right, buddy. Okay. Now. Oh, shoot. Okay. All right, Fritzy. Okay. Here we go. Thank you, Fritzy. Good boy. All right, let's see what happens. Good boy. You're going to get all the work. Good boy. We're just like hanging here, you mean? What if we get another Samurai Jack? Well, then we know not to use Fritzy anymore. <laughs> Well, Fritzy so far has us in the, the hole. In fact, oh, I was going to say, we haven't even pulled a, a single epic. Oh, okay. Fritzy. Fritzy Kitsy. It'd be kind of cool if you could get your wooden board, dude. Would you want that? That's the royalty. That's what I mean. Like, maybe no. we could pull enough cards to get it? I don't think we are, and I don't really care to. Okay, come on, Fritz. Here we go. Chris. You don't want to, you don't, come on. Can you can do it, you can do it two more times. Come on. All right, Fritzy, ready? Bring that paw up here. Oh, oh, shoot. Here, here. Okay, come on. Okay. He go. really doesn't like oh, this. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, go ahead. Oh, no, no, Fritzy, no. <laughs> He's getting very annoyed. Is he? Okay, yeah. sorry, Fritzy. I'm going to have to push the button. Sorry, Fritz. Sorry, buddy. <laughs>
Oh, I thought that was gonna be something big. No, that's I got a cool excited coin, for a second. Though. Yeah, it's a cool coin. It's that it's little okay, little head of that you thing. You can lay down again. There you go. Okay, I don't see anything happening here. I do like the Samurai Jacks. I don't care. I've got nothing bad to say about the Samurai Jacks. They're pretty cool. The fact that they're the easier ones to get kind of sucks, but it is what it is. All right, last one. Do you want to do this one? I have the honors. Oh, can't wait to put <laughs> Well, uh, this is crap. We can at least see how many cards we have at the end that make up the set, and you can get your wooden board, dude. What's I his don't name, Johnny or something? I want that. Yes, Johnny and Plank. You don't want the Johnny? No. So you don't even care? I told you I prefer you not buy packs. Heather, it was Heather. this this or this or I don't know what we're gonna do. Okay. I could that's talk it. about Funko Bros all day long. Well, I think we're done talking about that. I don't think we are. Okay, so let's see what we have here. Obviously we did some very horrible pulls. Two ultras. Oh my god, we're only fifty percent the way through. Okay, how many epic uh boy. Yeah, I, I don't wanna go after this. Twelve dollars eighty eight cents. For Samurai, oh, like that is, that's horrible. 17, 1836, $31 for Robo, Dexo, and Eustace is only $136. Yeah. That might be one of the lowest grails ever. Yeah. What do you think? Think it's sort of a mess what happened here? I think what, what the, the biggest mess is that you are the one who purchased packs. Well, so here's the thing. I like to open the packs because one, I have a gambling addiction. That I don't, I don't have a gambling addiction anywhere else, go. but only here, yeah. like only with NFTs. I don't, I don't gamble anywhere else. But I really enjoy opening the packs. It's fun, and it also makes it for fun content where people can see how weird. What the? What kind of moves are you putting on him? He's having a good time. You never scratched me so much where I flipped around and showed you my insides of my butthole. I mean, he really, he was showing off everything. But it's fun to open up the packs to see what's happening. We got a couple of Samurai Jacks. Not our best pulls. It's trash, I would say. But the Alien Drop, that's that's a whole other deal. Alien Drop is something that I'm really excited about. Are you going to be in with me? or? I mean, I'll be sitting right next to you as I complain about how you spent more money on NFTs, but that's fine. Yeah, I mean, that's that's kind of par for the course, though. Yeah. Anyway, the, the one Fungo Pop sold out, the, the Care Bear thing. Does anybody care about that? Anybody 5, care about people. that? 5,000 people or more. You never know if they're really limiting those things. Don't be silly. But the one big piece of information I did want to discuss that I actually posted on Instagram and I tagged everybody and their bro was the fact that there is a Marshalls Funko Pop being sold or, or a Funko Pop being sold at Marshalls. It is the, what? what is this? The, the, the social media, Freddy? It's a social media Freddy. Now, I cannot remember if, by the way, disc trackers liked it because I tagged them. Look at this. The warehouse probably was told to toss a lot of stuff, and these fell in the mix. I blame the fun days mess up. The fun that days mess be up. It. You think so? Yeah. Like it's all by accident? Oh, there's a hidden comment. What are people saying? First run ghastly, willing to pay $29.99, and I'll include a three pack of butter knives. Thank you. <laughs> I don't even know what that means, but nobody well, asked you, Scott. They're hoping that, or Scott is hoping that the Funko, or I'm sorry, the that the Ghastly will show up just like this Funko Pop over at Marshall's. I think that's what he's asking, or that's what he's hoping for. But it's interesting to see that this Funko Pop shows up. So the social media, Freddy, I remember, if I'm not mistaken, and I, and I could be, this is the one that they unveiled during New York Comic Con 2019 when I went. I feel like it's the same one. Really? Because they made a brand new social media Freddy figure. Now there may this may have been another iteration, I can't remember, but I swear it was in like a Letterman jacket like this. But it was such a huge deal there, and I remember everybody's joke was because they handed out one. And somebody in the audience got it. And basically it was gonna be like this social media Freddy won't hit the world until like next year. Because it was like at the end of the year of 2019. Well, they made a joke about how 
watch that show up on eBay. We know who you are now. Like if it goes up on eBay, we know it's you. I remember that being a big joke. And a lot of people were thinking, wow, this thing will probably go for a lot of money. At that point, it was rare. It was the only one in the world. Yeah. Well, now here it is for $30 at over Marshall's? at Marshall's. That's Unbelievable. I, you know, quite frankly, Funko is the reason for all of their own problems. I mean, they, you know, or their problems. They they create their own problems by doing stuff like this, like having to sell stuff and, and all these types of things uh, to maybe make ends meet. And they're just like piling things into the these big boxes and just shipping them places. We got to get rid of them. Got to get rid of them. We got more stuff coming in. It, it just doesn't look good. When I see that, like that should be something that you want to contest Right? Or you see them in person and they hand them out to you. Yeah. Walk into Marshalls and you're buying this stuff now? That's weird. What's next? Fun Day's item showing up at Marshalls? I, I mean, not really? Be surprised. I don't know what to think of this. This is crazy. We would like to know what you think about this and, and also our prems, as we premed it up pretty hard. And we also talked about the uh, Reese O'Brien, Tiny Ghost Deadpool, and Wolverine, which I think are really great figures. I love those. Uh, what do they call them? Sp I always forget the names. Are they called like pair of friends or something like that? Or oh no! Is it g g ghoul no, friends? you stop saying it. Oh my god, it's right there. They're called soulmates. Soulmates. Oh Jesus. my gosh! So by I the way, I knew that, and you knew that. Well, I'm an idiot. So, oh, by the way, they're called yeah. Dead Ghoul and Honey Badger. So forget everything I said before this. Limited edition of 200 per figure. LE25 chase per figure. Cool. So there's 50 chases out there and then 400 of these figures out there. Yeah, $140 so for the pair. It's two, It's 200 per figure yes. plus 25 of each. Chase. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. So great figures. I, I love them and, and I always love to support Tiny Ghost when I can, especially if it's something that I'm totally in love with. Mm -hmm. And this is one of them. Um, but we want to know what you guys think about everything we talked about in this video. What do you think about Fritzy? And what do you think about this video being completely unedited uh, for the most part? I think I have to cut out a couple things because Heather and I, we were talking behind the scenes about Mischief Toy stuff that I said that you could not hear. And Heather had to stop me. So if you see a cut in the video, it's because... I spoke too soon. That's why. Yeah, you like to do that. I'm a big old piece of shit. Hey. Let us know what we think about all this and more in the comment section down below. In every video, we like to shout out to some of our patrons for Patreon. In this video, we'd like to shout out to Nelson Shaner, Amy Richmond, Denver Bow, Adam Rubin, Brian Spears, Mark Wright, Veronica Knotts, Harley Malk, Marcus Gonzalez, and Nathan Maidman. Thank you guys so much for your continued support. We appreciate all of our patrons. You guys are amazing. And if you're not on our Patreon, boy, do you need to go and join right now because our upcoming Google Meet call that we do every single month is coming up for September. It actually will happen probably in a couple weekends. We're gonna release more information very soon. We have a ton of stuff to give away to include Halloween themed items. We also have a Hot Toys Loki to give away from Avengers Endgame and we have one figure that we're going to be giving away that is going to be our day one NYCC figure. Our patrons will see this figure for the very first time and we'll select one winner to take it home. They will be the first person to have this figure in their little paws and in their little grips. But the thing is, you will not see it later on, a couple years later, at Marshall's. I can at least promise that. So check out patreon.com slash castlecast for more information. We will have more thrill spills and chills for this upcoming September Patreon call via Google Meet. And make sure you hit the like button, subscribe button, and a little bell. That way you'll know anytime we go live or post brand new content. You don't want to miss our new content like this video right here. Wasn't it a blast? And then how about our lives every Sunday between 8 and 9 p.m. Eastern? Come and hang out with us. We have a lot of fun. We talk about all sorts of things to include Funko, Mischief Toys, even sometimes we'll discuss Hot Toys and other collectibles. And this past live, we actually sat down with Christian from HobbyDB slash PPG to discuss all the changes that have been going on. If you missed that live, go back and watch it now. I highly re recommend I highly recommend checking that one out. All right, that's all we've got for you. Thank you so much for staying until the end. We appreciate you, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.